Everyone hello my most beloved viewers, you are on the Did You Know channel. Today I will tell you and show you the most expensive cars in the world. Watch the video to the end and you will know how much the most expensive car in the world costs. And the car opens this list. Coupe Lamborghini Sion, which appeared, became the first hybrid model in the history of the Italian brand. It is already known that the company is actively investing in electrification and the successor to the Aventador will also be a hybrid. Meanwhile, the convertible Lamborghini Sion Roadster was prepared. The new Lamborghini Sion Roadster looks very bright and daring. The source of inspiration was the iconic Lamborghini Countach, although it never had a convertible version. The design of the hood cover, lights and wing was spied on him. Well, the wedge-shaped profile and guillotine doors are the signature features of Lamborghini, but the Y-shaped LED headlights are details of the brand's new style. The hard roof is removable. Carbon is actively used in the design, so the hybrid weighs 1,650 kilograms. The interior of the Lamborghini Sion Roadster is decorated with carbon fiber and suede. The coupe received a digital instrument panel, and a touchscreen display of the multimedia system in tablet format is installed on the central panel. The bucket-shaped sports seats have a carbon frame. The V12 engine with a volume of 6.5 liters was borrowed from the Lamborghini Aventador SVJ, but refined and raised to 785 horsepower. It is paired with a small 34 horsepower electric motor that provides increased power during acceleration. Instead of a battery, a supercapacitor is installed, where regenerative braking energy is stored. Acceleration to 100 km per hour takes 2.9 seconds, and the maximum speed exceeds 350 km per hour. The car can also move on electric traction. The Lamborghini Sion Roadster is all-wheel drive and equipped with a 7-speed dual-clutch transmission. Steerable rear wheels and adaptive shock absorbers are installed, and car carbon ceramic brakes slow down. The new Lamborghini Sion Roadster will be released in a limited series of 19 cars. All of them are already sold out, despite the outrageous price tag of $3.7 million. Bugatti Chiron Supersport The maximum speed of 440 km per hour, the price of 3.2 million euros and only 9 copies for the whole world these are the key characteristics of the new product. No matter what you say, Bugatti knows how to celebrate anniversaries brightly. A recent example is a special version of the Chiron with the Super Sport prefix. The car was presented 90 years after the debut of the brand's first model with this designation, Bugatti Type 55 Super Sport. The philosophy is the same, we are talking about a high-speed car, the driving characteristics of which are formed with an emphasis on comfort, and taking into account the power of the Chiron Super Sport and, as a result, the maximum speed, it is quite logical that that the engineers worked extremely carefully with the aerodynamics. Externally, the Bugatti Chiron Super Sport is distinguished by a 25 cm longer rear part of the body, as in the record-breaking prototype Chiron Super Sport 300, shown in 2019. There are no protruding elements on the body, which is made to maximally smooth the passage of airflow, and the area of the diffuser has grown to increase downforce at high speeds. And how else, if the branded 8-liter W16 with four turbines is installed in the engine compartment, the return of which, compared to the standard Chiron, is increased by 100 horsepower, up to 1,600 horsepower. At the same time, the range in which a gigantic torque is available, 1,600 newton meters, has been expanded. The transmission has a longer and higher seventh gear to achieve a higher top speed. As a result, according to Bugatti, the car is perfectly controlled even at a maximum speed of 440 km per hour. By the way, compared to the previously presented version of the Chiron Per Sport, the Michelin Tire Company created optimized Pilot Sport Cup 2 tires that can withstand speeds of up to 500 km per hour. The rubber is mounted on individual aluminum discs with five Y-shaped spokes. As the head of the brand, Stefan Winkelmann, said when presenting the Chiron Super Sport, Bugatti created the biggest Gran Turismo in history, which is ideal for long trips. The car is inspired by the Bugatti Type 57 SC Atlantic, the design concept is taken from the Bugatti Vision Gran Turismo. The main purpose of the car is high results on the racetrack. The exhaust system of the car has been changed, there are four exhaust pipes. The width of the rear fixed wing is 1.8 meters, it is 23% wider. 
than the similar anti-wing figure on the Veyron. Before the incoming air gets into the engine and onto the wing, it is separated by a knockaduct to improve downforce. In addition, for better aerodynamics and brake cooling, a large front splitter and side skirts are installed. The car is powered by a W16 engine equipped with four turbochargers with a capacity of 1,479 horsepower. It is paired with a seven-speed robotic gearbox with a double clutch. All this allows you to accelerate to 100 km per hour in 2.4 seconds. The maximum speed of the car is limited to 380 km per hour. Bugatti planned to produce only 40 cars, their assembly was carried out at the company's main factory. All 40 cars were sold to order to existing Bugatti Chiron owners even before the opening of free sales. In the summer of 2021, production was completed. Pagani Huira Tricolor Pagani Huira has been produced since 2011, and less than 300 cars have been produced during this time. Moreover, some versions exist only in a few copies. For example, the Pagani Huira Tricolor Cabriolet will be released in an amount of only three pieces. It was dedicated to the Italian aerobatic group Frec Tricolori, which is celebrating its 60th anniversary. The design of the Pagani Huayra is maintained in the colors of the Frec Tricolori aircraft. All five convertibles were painted blue with stripes in the form of Italian flags on the sides. Of course, this was not enough, and a new front bumper and a carbon aerodynamic body were created for the Huayra Tricolor. The new air intake on the roof, connected by a peculiar keel with an enlarged anti-wing, also attracts attention. Special and forged wheels with a diameter of 20 inches at the front and 21 inches at the rear. In other respects, the design is familiar four headlights, a pronounced nose, and an interior moved forward. All body panels are made of carbon fiber, and titanium is used in the design, so the weight of the cabriolet is only 1,270 kilograms. The interior of the Pagani Huera Tricolor also features blue details and images of Italian flags. In addition, inserts made of aviation aluminum alloys were used. The rim of the three-spoke steering wheel is flat from below. The dials of the devices are designed like an expensive Swiss watch, and the ventilation deflectors resemble turbines. The lever of the transmission has an open mechanism. Tricolor also featured decorative elements in the form of aviation instruments, a pitot tube and an anemometer. The Pagani Huayra engine is produced by the Mercedes AMG division and assembled by hand by one person. For the Tricolor, this 6.0-liter turbocharged V12 has been refined and now develops 840 horsepower, and the maximum torque, which twists, has grown to a significant 1,100 newton meters. This is the most powerful model of the brand. Acceleration to 100 km per hour takes about 2.8 seconds, and the maximum speed exceeds 370 km per hour. The Cabriolet received adaptive Aline's shock absorbers. Slowing it down are 398 mm Brembo carbon ceramic brakes up front, and 380 mm at the back. The new Pagani Huayra Tricolor will be very expensive, 5.5 million euros. Bugatti Senta Diasi. In 2019, the Bugatti brand celebrated its 110th anniversary. Several interesting models and special versions were dedicated to this date, and now a new Bugatti Senta Diasi has been prepared for the anniversary. Its name is translated from Italian as 110. However, in the history of the brand, there was already a Bugatti EB 110 1991 and they tried to make the newcomer look like this model. In the style of the ancestor, the air intakes in the front bumper are worn, and the narrow diode headlights are also made in a familiar style. In addition, characteristic round holes appeared behind the side windows, as in the EB110. An aerodynamic body kit and original carbon wheels are also provided. The engine is covered with a transparent hood cover. At the back, attention is drawn to the huge wing and lights on the entire width of the body. Unusually, there are four exhaust pipes in two floors. In general, Senta Diaside looks original and original and outwardly has little in common with the Bugatti Chiron, on the basis of which it is built. By the way, it is 20 kilograms lighter than the donor model, it weighs 1,975 kilograms. The finish combines leather and carbon, and the driver and passenger are separated by an original arch. The Bugatti Senta Diaside is powered by the familiar 8.0-liter W16 with four turbines. 
but its power has been increased to 1,600 horsepower. Acceleration to 100 km per hour takes 2.4 seconds, to 200 km per hour in 6.1 seconds, and to 300 km in 13.1 seconds. The maximum speed is lower than that of the Chiron, limited to 380 km per hour. The arsenal of Sentadiasi includes all-wheel drive, adaptive shock absorbers and active suspension with variable clearance. Carbon ceramic brakes are responsible for slowing down. The new Bugatti Sentadiasi will be released in a limited series of 10 cars. Such an exclusive is not cheap, the price of the coupe is 9 million euros. Pagani Zonda is a real veteran in the segment of exotic sports cars. It was shown for the first time back in 1999, and it is still produced in small series to order, because there is a demand. The latest addition to the Zonda lineup is the HP Barchetta convertible. The new Pagani Zonda HP Barchetta looks familiar and retains the signature wedge-shaped silhouette. The signature round headlights and four exhaust pipes in the form of rocket nozzles remained. At the same time, the front and side windows of the cabriolet are cut and the roof is missing. An additional air intake appeared behind the backs of the seats. The rear wheels are covered with special aerodynamic overlays, and a large anti-wing is provided. The body is made of especially light carbon, which allowed to keep the weight at the level of 1250 kilograms. In the interior, carbon fiber is combined with leather and polished aluminum, and the small steering wheel is decorated with wood. The instruments resemble an antique clock, and the switches on the center panel look like aviation toggle switches. Interestingly, the interior door handles are made of leather. Sports seats are decorated with checkered inserts like the 50s. The Pagani Zonda HP Barchetta convertible is powered by the twin-turbo 6.0-liter V12 from the more modern Huayra BC model. This engine produced by Mercedes-AMG develops 800 horsepower and has a torque of 1,100 newton meters. However, unlike the donor model, there is not a robotic, but a six-speed manual gearbox. A high-friction differential is also provided. A number of suspension parts and carbon ceramic brakes with a diameter of 380 mm are borrowed from the Pagani Huayra BC. Special alloy wheels with 255 by 30 are 20 front and 335 by 25 are 21 rear tires are also installed. Only three units of the new Pagani Zonda HP Barchetta will be produced. The price of the cabriolet is high, 15 million euros.